Hello, everybody, and welcome to the third episode of Paper Mario Master Quest Junior. Last time, we uh, dis we defeated the Goomba King. We got Speedy Spin from Twink, and we made our way through. I think it's called Pleasant Path. So yeah, we made it to Koopa Village, and uh, all the Koopas are being harassed by Fuzzies. Uh, we don't care, however. Also, Koopa Leaf. I can't hold any more items. About to fight John. I'm gonna want to find the shop anyways here, because I want to store some stuff. Also, I want to check the shop, just anyways. Did I miss the sh- Isn't- I swear to god there's a shop here. Is there not? Am I being dumb? I might actually be dumb right now. There might not be a shop here. Yeah, okay, it's right here. Never mind. Bam. So, uh, Dizzy Dial, Pow Block, Fire Flower, Honey Syrup, Volt Shroom, and Mushroom. All overpriced to hell, but it's fine. I'm gonna check some stuff in. I'm gonna store some stuff. I'm gonna store in the Super Shroom. And I want to store in both dried shrooms, since I believe these can be used in some recipes later. I will keep the rest on me. Anyway. Let's, uh, get, there's a star piece here. Uh, isn't there? Oh fuck, dude! I my memory is failing me again. Hold up a second. It's probably about time I pull up that guide, isn't it? Because uh, I'm not gonna be able to remember where everything is. Okay, I said for star piece paper. That's not. That's not okay. Cool. That's better. There you go. Yeah, there's, there's four. There's actually five, but it's fine. I'll allow it. Of course, Koopa, 15, and on a high break. Yeah, so that star piece has been removed, I guess, because I, as I said, there's a star piece here. Actually, no, it's not removed. It's because it's after the fuzzies. Dude, I need to get better at this game. Oh my god, I'm so psyched. I need my blue shell. Anyways. Let's uh, head in and kill this. This is the only fuzzy that's actually required to kill. <laughs> and yeah, actually, you don't even fight the others. You literally just... Okay, can you fuck off? Dude? I kind of don't want to deal with you. I'll deal with you after when I have Cooper. If you're still there at that point. I don't know if you are. Maybe you are, maybe you aren't. The memory game. The fact that they haven't taken this out is upsetting. <laughs> because this is just a waste of time. But okay. Do you know where the blue shell is? Comment below to help the YouTube algorithm. <laughs> Alright, you have to do this three times. Boom, 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 boom. You know, honestly, what the fuck are the odds of them being so coordinated? Like, just on first draft. Like, they're literally... They're not hitting each other in the air. They are literally just... Doing this first try. <laughs> okay, we got the show. And then Cooper comes in. My boy. And I believe we get him as a party member here. Oh, dude, I just got... Freaking... I don't know what it's called in English. Uh, it's called Tinnitus in Danish. It's like we get a very high uh, screeching noise. Like, imagine your TV is, like, crashing and shit. Like, that just sometimes happens to my ears. I don't have that. 
But sometimes that literally comes out of nowhere. It's really weird. Anyway, four fuzzies. Uh, it's actually kind of annoying. We actually have Cooper out right now. I'm actually going to switch to Goombario. I'm actually going to tattle. Fuzzy here. Now, this guard right here is one of the hardest guards in the game. Two damage. I hit it. Also, they heal, which is annoying. I'm actually hitting this. Yeah, I'm so used to the TTYD thing. Yeah, so, uh... How much damage does Power Shell do again? Because a Power Block isn't going to be enough. I don't even have a Fire Flower, actually. Um, That's pretty bad. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to heal for Mushroom. And then I'm going to switch to Cooper. There you go. Time to guard again. There you go. Nice. I actually hit the guard all four times. So, has Farsha been nerfed? Yeah, only two damage. Usually does three. Unless Fuzzies have defense. Which I don't think they do. Nevertheless, they're dead. Eight star points. Me York. All right, let's get out of here. And now, because we have Cooper, we are able to get this badge right here, HP plus. This is the badge I was talking about before. For free BP, I can increase my HP by five. This is basically what we're going to be building both our HP and our FP supplies on at the beginning. Because there is <laughs> literally no reason. I guess actually upgrading FP early isn't that bad idea. But there's just so many good badges early game that you really want, dude, when you try to walk bottom right. <laughs> anyway, here's the start piece I was talking about. I believe I can also start the Koopa Coot side quest, which will be very nice because this guy's going to give us star pieces in the end. No, I know, I know, I know, I know. We're going to do this while we're here because <laughs> we have literally nothing else to do. Uh, Colorado's... Oh, Chuck Quizmo's here? Oh, sweet. We get this early. That's actually really nice. So thankfully, this time you don't have to backtrack back and forth constantly. This guy's button right. Is that another question? I'm not sure. Also, uh, one a cool thing to note. Uh, I played this game on Wii Virtual Console for the first time. When you answer correctly, instead of him putting that circle up from his hat, it's just a giant circle on the screen. I don't know if that's just a PAL thing, but it's kind of weird. What's a zero SP? Oh, yeah, zero star points. Right, I was gonna say, isn't it zero BP? It's not zero BP, it's zero SP. Anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna try to get as many of these as possible. How many bushes can you find? Seven, I think. Yeah. And if I screw up, I won't, like, I'll have to backtrack if I screw up. That's just a thing, I guess. Isn't it sincerely? It is. Okay. See, she says all of, I think she said all of these in previous Mario games. Maybe except for best best wishes. She definitely says yours truly before. Me, Windows other than Goomba Village. Two. Yeah. Cause there's two in the same house. There's only one house in Goomba Village. Let's see. Question: Which one of Goomba Kings may have more hell health? Red Goomba. Red Goomba has seven. Blue Goomba has six. I believe it's the same in Vanilla, actually. There you go. That's all the questions we can do for now. Let's go say hi to Colorado's wife.
This isn't Colorado's house, actually. Wait, yeah, I'm the wrong. I'm in the wrong place. I'll take a nap real quick. To heal. I'll also go back for that. Actually, no, there's no reason to go back for it because we'll have to get it anyways later. Also, can we just talk for a moment about how fucking good the soundtrack in this game is? I believe this is it. There we go. So, yeah. Colorado's a character we're gonna become much more affiliated with later. Uh, but, for now, let me do this. So these side quests are gonna seem very pointless now. They're not pointless. There we go, Koopa Legends. One coin. I believe he wants a sleepy sheep now. Thankfully, we have two sleepy sheeps on us right now. And this is the thing we actually want right now. The silver credit. Yeah, he doesn't have any more for us, thank god. I do not think there's any more new enemies. I'm trying to think there's more new enemies. <gasps> Because if there are, I want to switch to Goombario. But I am pretty sure we can stay as Cooper. Do, 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 do. Why am I not spinning, dude? I need to remember to spin. I've been playing so much TTYD. Somebody make a count on how many times I say that. Try to play th through. Hi. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, uh, let's... Let's do a power shell here. Because that will knock out. Yeah, so Power Shell used to be 3 FP, 3 damage. Now it's 2 FP, 2 damage. Which I think it's a pretty fair trade off. Nice block, Mario. It's better. Uh, let's take out. I guess. Yeah, let's just get rid of. Bit of HP here. It doesn't matter in the end. Three damage? Was Shell Toss buffed? I'm gonna. Dude, if I keep missing these guards, there's no way I'm gonna be able to beat this game. <laughs> but yeah, no, like. Interesting. They actually buffed uh, Shell Toss. That's actually a really nice change. I'm a big fan of that. Here we have a Thunderbolt. This has been changed. Normally it does like a set amount of attack power to just one enemy. And now, instead, it does one attack power but shrinks. Oh, there's an enemy here. A new enemy. Uh, tell you what, I'm gonna power jump the Fuzzy. And then she'll toss the Spike Goomba. Dude, okay. That's not gonna be fun. Change to Goombario. It's gonna be like, yo, what up, man? This is a Paragoomba. A Paragoom. Yeah, great job. Yeah, this is a Paragoomba, guys. Fun fact. Please stop missing action commands, dude. Oh yeah, I'm not supposed to use power shell. Here we go. Bam. I'm actually really happy that shell toss been buffed because that's gonna make this early game a lot more manageable. Thank God. Anyway, here we use Koopa for the first time. Bam. Another paratrooper up there. That's, uh, worrying. If I can first strike this guy, let me first strike myself. I don't exactly have to chill out right now. Okay, I'll take that. Um. I would like to have Goombario here. This is a mess and a half. 
because yeah, I'm gonna have to let this. I'm gonna have to let the fuzzy live. I think I'm just gonna want to get these guys down for now. Yeah. And then I guess. We'll, I guess I'll stay in, yeah. So now this guy's gonna be stuck. This guy's gonna do that. And then now. I'm gonna do one. And then one. Perfect. Now I can knock down this paratrooper. I'm, I have to guard around here though, because uh, if I don't, I'm in trouble. Yeah. Case in point. That's my last healing item. Have to use it here. Dude, stop. Danny. <laughs> oh my fucking god, dude. Okay, tell you what, knock this guy down. So I wonder, does this guy do one or two damage when you don't hit the action command? Please hit it. Thank you. For once I actually did something good. Now get rid of this piece of shit. Ba -bum. Boop. Right, I might have to dodge enemy battles for a little bit until I reach uh, next up. Okay, that's yeah. I kind of needed more. That's fine. Fire flower here. Maybe I should use my eyes. I have a sleepy sheep. I'm not using it. Okay, well, let's get the star piece. There you go. Okay, this is fine. I will power shell. And then I'll get rid of the fuzzy. Thank you. At this point, I'm just worried about missing the fucking action commands. There we go. Alright. That's pretty helpful. We got a Koopa Leaf as well. I'm running. I don't like to run from fights, but right now it's necessary. Collect the coins that were left here anyways. There we go. Now I'm gonna go back. <laughs> And fight this guy. Let's see if I can. There we go. That's better. Uh, interesting layout here. I'm gonna hammer throw. I want power shell here. I don't think. Dude, actually, Danny, hit your guards, man. If I... No, no, it's not gonna work. I'm gonna set up a power shelling, I think. This way I can get rid of all the threats, and then I can uh, stun lock the coop. That didn't work? Okay. Uh, yeah, kill this coop with them. There you go. And now we should be good to go. Almost did that too early. We just stupid because there's only so many frames after the fact where you still have time to hit it. Whatever. Alrighty then. Hit the health block.
Let's save here. Nothing uh, too much here. Like Ninji Koopa. There's nothing around the edge here, is there? No. <laughs> Let's go for it. I'm gonna want a uh, Goombario out here, I think. There we go. Boop. Oh boy. Uh, lots of shit to tackle here, clearly. Let's begin with uh, tattling the bob -omb. And then I'll stun lock the Koopa. Dude, these guys' jumps are slow. Uh, all right, that guy's on fire. Or on fire. I'm gonna have to wait with the tattle a bit. I need to kill this guy. And then... Hammer. There we go. Now we're just at two. Alright, so let's just uh, hammer this guy to death. Poof. And then Tattle, the White Ninja Koopa. I apologize for not uh, reading the Tattles on the other ones. I think he's a brother to the others. I don't think he's a brother to the others, but he seems to want to prove his worth to them. He's almost as strong as they are, but that isn't saying much. They practice ninja skills, so if he, care so if he jumps, be careful he doesn't sneak up on us. He also buffs allies' defense. In other words, this guy's a real pain in the ass. Also, he just buffed his own defense. Piece of shit. Will he even do damage then? I, I'm not even doing damage. Okay. Uh, can I hit down? Thank you. Okay, cool. If you can get up and attack on the same turn, of course you can. Other than that, dude, this guy has one defense. That's actually so annoying. Okay. So that's going to do two damage, yeah. I can't hit that guard. I just can't hit the guard. Bro, I'm so bad. Oh my god. I should probably hammer him, but I think this is better because then I can use Cooper to easily wreck him. Anyways, that was a mess of a fight. Bob-omb. I probably should have hammered. Dude, what's up with these formations? This is... Uh... Alright, let's... Knock down the paratrooper. And then shell toss. One bob I'm dead. He can't do shit. Nice guard. He... Okay. This forces me to use power shell. And then hammer throw. I want to just skip a lot of these fights. Because clearly these fights just wear me down completely. I just don't want to be under leveled. I guess that's my main problem. I might want to have to scrap the idea of battling every, or at least most enemies. Be God, dude, I, no, I'm not forced to fight you. You can stay there. I'll come back for you if I want to. I'm going to fight what's necessary, I feel like. Honestly, it might be worth it to just backtrack. Whoa, shit. We can use, use a bug here to go in here and get gam Gambler's Jump. Unless this thing has gotten a balance update, which I seriously do not think it has, then this is possibly a contender for the worst badge in the game. Um, at this point, 
gam at least in original, unless it's been patched. Of course, I've again, I've only seen 1.0. It costed one, no, it costed three FP, and nine out of ten times it would do one damage. One out of ten times you do five damage, I think, or like ten damage or something. And it's just not worth it. It's just never worth it compared to power jump, which always does four. Um, honestly, I might... Yeah, I'm gonna end the episode here. Because I don't think I can make it to the next save block in time. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Master Quest Jr. If you enjoyed, make sure to smash like, because I'm a sellout. And yeah, I will catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.